Deathheim! This will be the final of the. I was gonna say final because that would have been cooler, but this, this will be the final battle. The last battle. All monsters will be completely eliminated from this world. Sir Wild, are you ready? Fuck yeah. Our final battle. Mumra's evil cousin. But not as evil. Uh, the way they got his face looking, man. I've beaten this before. Why can't I have that, that Start, I think. thing that fucking like shoots lasers now? I can see you're doing better than you were. Unless I'm getting the hang of what he's doing. Yeah, you did way better that time. Now it's gonna be the stick face. Yep. This guy's fucking horrible to deal with. Make your mind up, bitch! I think the trick is to not be higher than him. Yep, you want to be below him. That much is definitely true. Yeah. Man, this guy's just slow. I remember being a little slower uh, when we played against him the first time. Yeah. If I can get him on this, it'd be great. I think you'll get me, it's just being incredibly annoying. You're catching up to him on damage, so... It's sticky for her to hurt him, but he is not touching you. Yeah. I think I'm getting the hang of what makes him spawn where. That was beautiful. I think I'm getting it. Yeah, you just made him do the same thing twice. Okay, now he's gonna change it up. What the fuck, game? There we go. That's what I was trying to do. Yeah. That one, that one is just nasty. Well, when he turns into the, what's it called? Werewolf. Yeah. Okay. I just gotta play a little. With the when he shoots out the arrow things, don't chase after them. Just jump over them when they shoot you. Because they disappear. So. One of the things I was doing is you just go over to destroy him, you take damage and then they disappear anyway. Hope that helps. Yeah, that's helping. I'm not worried about him as much. There we go. Yeah, I'm freaking King Todd. I don't think he hit me once. No, I don't think he did. He might have landed on me. He might have. Now it's this guy. Freaking poor. This thing's straight into the freaking Castlevania. That's why I already know what it is. There we go. Yeah, I think that's appropriate use on this boss. It just makes it a lot easier. Alright, this dickhead. Ah, 
God, this fight is so slow. This feels like I'm doing more damage. Yeah. Yeah, being able to do two on him really helps. Kind of getting my groove here. Look like you're already in it. Yeah. Well, I meant for this. It seems like this round I'm doing a lot better because I'm remembering. Makes sense. Oh. Okay. Well, let's go too soon. Damn it. I'm a little nervous. That's what the issue is. Come on. Drop it. Okay. That works. I mean, I've gotten through all these games. For the next one, I think you'll be okay. You took out a whole bunch on one life. Yeah. Able to do better than just suicide charge unless you got like, an easy fight, which you do not. Yeah. Which is not making it easy. <laughs> nah. So a fresh fight on that will help a lot. Plus you got magic and this is a fight where it will help you. Massively as it turns out. For magic, or you still got one? I got two. I'm gonna okay, hold off on for a big thing. Oh shit. It's okay. You could probably save those for the big fight. You almost got this guy. Got him. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Alright. You're doing great. Actually, yeah. <sighs> okay. You pull you got two magic. You're beating the shit out of this guy when you hit him. There we go. Here we go. There's Hordak. I was actually going to suggest that when they get the shit up on the screen, that's a good time for it. Damn. Oh, he's changing it up. Damn. I gotta, I gotta get his, his little shooting timing thing down. I saw the third form. <gasps> Run like a chicken with my head cut off! Ow. <laughs> God, I gotta get when he shoots that. Uh, do I duck or it looks like I have to duck? Okay, ducking. Oh, I'm a dumbass. 
Got him! Did I do it? <laughs> Two forms. Fuck you! Fuck him! With Fuck one, you! With one life left. Evil cousin. Deathheim clear. <laughs> you did it. Fuck yes. It's free of the evils. It's clear. Look at that. Look at that beautiful cliff I'm on. That's so pretty. I love the little ocean in the background too. Endless ocean. There Endless we go. ocean. So wild. You have been a tireless master. Well, I haven't. I, I haven't stopped. With this, our current duties are complete. We have labored long and hard, long and hard, giggity, uh. to help our people become free. I do feel a bit of regret that they will no longer, they will on longer need our help. Uh. On. Someone's getting fired. Let's take one last look at each of the thriving towns we helped develop. Getting a bit of an epilogue here. This is cool. Yes. And you finally get to Good see old. the game beat. Yeah. This is Fillmore. Look how the people cleared and cultivated the land and constructed a prospering town. I know, I was there. Oh, yes. One of the men in Fillmore had a, the ability to predict the future. His ability helped save Fillmore. All caps. He finally gave his life for his town. I'm sure he expected that final fate. Well, he could see the future, so. From birth, all people are guided by a force called destiny. Because I call bullshit on that. <laughs> because, well, you know. Because people are unaware of their destiny... They may not understand all that life has to offer. The man who quietly accepts his destiny is also the one who became, becomes a great leader. Well, not if you're dead in person. Also right. not if you're dead. On to Bloodmore. Bloodpool. This is Bloodpool. The lake has already returned to its beautiful blue color. Oh yes, there was an energetic boy named Teddy. Oh, I remember Teddy. Sir Wild and I are supposed to treat all people equally. But since he was such a likable young boy, young, young scrap, he received much of our attention. Well, I mean, not really. Oh, do you remember the people of Bloodpool had to draw lots to decide who was to be sacrificed? Yeah, I remember. They didn't talk to me. At the time, I didn't tell you, but I knew whose lot was drawn. Damn. It was Teddy. It was Teddy. Well, they told me. <laughs> On to Kusanan Kasandora. California. Yes. This is the desert town, California. <laughs> now there is a very little. Now there's very little evidence of the once massive desert. People said they were drawn into the pyramid by its magical powers. But should we believe this? monsters living in the pyramid were nothing more than reincarnations of the human slaves who were built who built the pyramid their spirits remained drawing people's minds to the pyramid say pyramid again now the pyramid damn it is sealed and their souls saved they will be reborn as human beings. Yay! Happy ending, guys. Yay! Now we're going to 
Adios. Adios. <laughs> this is the volcanic town. Adios. At Atos. I was so impressed by these people who tried to build homes in spite of the continuous lava flow, which didn't really have that problem. That's really called stupidity, but okay. Yeah. Their leader passed from this life right before your very eyes. I am certain he dedicated his whole life to informing people of your existence. Well, I'm glad. I hope Adios would become a beautiful town representative of his great spirit. Okay. On to the next town. Oh, we're going straight to uh, Maharajana. Maharaja. This is the jungle town in Klingon. My, my, they have built so many homes on such a small island. Well, yeah, I kind of destroyed the first set. I felt very sad when the town's two leaders were tempted by the wicked mirror. Mirror. But human beings have a tendency to choose the easier way when faced with difficulties. Well, you know. I mean, why would you choose a more difficult path unless you True. know it was a better path? Having seen the people's weakness, I felt obligated to lead them into the right direction. How? I did the fucking work. Okay, North Wall. Here we are. What do you got to say about North Wall? This is the last of our lands, North Wall. I felt a little guilty about letting people live in such a cold climate. But they successfully overcame many problems. Their two leaders were telling us that when they found the two initials on the mighty tree, they felt a certain affection towards what or who had left the initials. I think those two leaders were sweethearts who had lived here long ago, but were killed by monsters. That's nice. Their spirits have since come to dwell in these bodies. If my story is correct, the sweethearts have finally reunited after a long separation. Explain why they knew how long it had been. Exactly. Even though they don't remember, it's a beauty. Isn't it a beautiful story? This being so, it seems your people as well as yourself have had a hard have had hard times. So Wild why don't we take a look inside the shrine? Oh we're gonna catch him fucking. Oh my Oh damn. I was expecting some humpity hump. There's no one here. The for in former times people would call you and ask for your help. Yeah every five seconds as cultures and lands become more advanced, do people tend to forget those who help them? Yes. Yeah. Typically. But then people may be most happy when not in need of help from their master. I'd rather just be called wild. Or when they have forgotten him. Question mark. Should we yearn for a time when people will no longer need ask for our help? Hmm. I mean, they won't be bothering you as much. It right. will no longer be unexpected. Yeah. Off to space. We're here needed. Bye! My people need me. <laughs> Staff of Act Razor. Listen to that that music. I'm surprised I beat that so quick. <laughs> Copyright! 1990! Quintets! 
Or one out for Quintet. 91! I missed them. Enix Corporation Quintet based on Actraiser, licensed by Nintendo.